early, around two o'clock, two o'clock this afternoon, there was a, a report of a gunfire gun fire inside uh, the school. Uh, deputy sheriffs were the first to be on the scene within a few minutes. What we uh, d uh, discovered when officers arrived here is that we had uh, one adult female that suffered a gunshot wound. She is a teacher here at the school. She was transported to a local hospital where I can tell you that is where our thoughts and prayers are at right now, that she is still considered, her injuries are still considered life-threatening, but she, there was some improvement the last update that we got. Uh, the, the individual is a, a six-year-old uh, student. Uh, he is right now in police custody as we're working at the best way to our partners and different resources to address that situation. We have been in contact with our Commonwealth attorney uh, and, and some other entities to help us best get services to this to this um, this young man. The only thing I can tell you is that the altercation was between a six-year-old, the, the student uh, who did have the firearm, and the teacher, and then a round was fired. Um, like I said, she suffered a, a gunshot wound and has been transported to the hospital. That's where my thoughts and prayers are at right now. Um, when I leave here, I'm going to get another update, but Chief Grinstead has been keeping us informed about how she's doing at, at, the, at the hospital. And she, so was this shooting intentional or accidental? This was not an accidental shooting.